Hello, this is uh, video number two uh, for Thursday, uh, January 11th, uh, 2018, and my name is Matt Wright, uh, here in Richmond, Virginia, and out taking the dog for a walk, if you haven't seen the first video, his name is Scout, uh, Siberian Husky Black Lab Mix. But anyway, what I'm doing, the purpose of the second video is that I'm going to talk about, I look better with shades on, but most of my other videos, it's about all of them, I always have them on. But anyway, I'm where at the place where I had my first, uh, uh, first real job, like officially. Uh, not under the table, stuff like that when I was 16. Now it's not open anymore. It's been closed for a long time, this place. But I'm in the back right now. See it? This is uh, the, right across from Regency Square Mall uh, on Quia and this is on Cuyacuson Road and Old Toys R Us, which is, and for those of you who don't know, I am um, an intuitive. Some people call it psychic. Either word is, is the same thing. Uh, um, represents the same thing pretty much. Um, I'm a um, um, spirit medium, uh, empath, uh, amongst other things. Energy healer as well. And I've had those abilities all my life. They just keep getting stronger, especially since that. Well, the past 16 years, uh, like, like uh, they they've been increasing. Uh, seems with every passing day, uh, drastically. But this is a whole nother subject. On the last video, we were talking about the would-be rulers of this world and the divide and conquer uh, tactics they uh, stoke in, in the world population in order to distract people so they can uh, quietly, in the background, conquer you. But anyway, what I'm getting, this is a, this area, I call it, uh, most of this Weston and Rico area of Richmond that that I'm in now, that I live in, I call it the literal uh, twilight zone, because it is. It feels like a negative twilight zone of uh, what's going on here. Okay, that's Regency Square Mall. A dead mall. It's been dead, hardly any business, even at Christmas the past few years, not as much business as it was in the uh, early, mid-2000s uh, and the 90s. Uh, you know, and they're, but they're building all this new stuff, renovating stuff, uh, new, uh, you know, why would you do that? Because you need it to be a makeshift FEMA camp, FEMA prison, when the time comes. Now, this is where, as I said, I'm going to, this is where I had my first like uh, official non um, under the table job when I just turned 16 uh, back in the very early 90s. I, this used to be a Toys R Us. I worked here almost three years and it's been, like I said, shut down for years. But look at it. Hope you all can see, all right? See? See how it's been emptied out. And it's been like this for many years. But it seems like it's been renovated from the outset. I don't remember it like this uh, when, um, when I was here or after that. Um, and you can tell there's stuff going on inside. Let's go by the inside again, Scott. Wanna go by the inside again, Scott? There's Regency again. You see the whole road shut off. Now there's 
of that Walmart being expanded right next door to this Toys R Us. And oh, that's gonna, I feel that intuitively. That's gonna be another one. Uh, everybody, a lot of people know that already. Walmarts are definitely part of it. that. But look at that. Doesn't that remind you of something there? See? And the stuff I'm seeing here is not dusty. It's not dusty. Do these boxes and all? And yet, I haven't seen anybody working over here. And look at this. A cable set up. Hmm. But this is going to be one. I just wanted to touch on that real quick. So look for buildings like this in your area. Look at that. Did you hear that? The alarm right there. Can you see that alarm? On the wall. Right there with the green display. When I walked by it, I heard it beep. So there's something definitely going on here. I know I'm trying to keep these videos shorter. It's getting darker and it's starting to rain. So I'm gonna hold, let me see if it beeps again. Not that time. Ha ha ha. Now let's see. I was noticed something in the back. Let's just go take a quick look before I... Okay. New spotlights there. New spotlights. There's the Walmart being built up right there. Ironically, I used to work in that building back in the very early 90s. Oh, when it used to be... It was a ro called Roses, it was a kind of department store. I think they went bankrupt uh, a good while ago. But this stuff is expanding. And Toys R Us, uh, speaking of bankrupt, uh, they've gone bankrupt. Um, but I think, yeah, they're about to go bankrupt. Yeah, they have gone bankrupt, I believe, recently. So anyway, yep. You want to see a uh, scout? You want to see this FEMA Walmart, huh? Oh yeah. New kinds of devices out there. I don't know if you see those white ones there. Uh, of course, the cameras on top, just the back. We'll have to do another video sometime about that. And this thing has been there a long time, that dumpster. I mean, not a long time, it, like that. I don't believe it's been there that long. And ironically, guess what? Before I close this video out, yeah. Right behind this. <laughs> I was just laughing at some graffiti on the wall. I had somebody wrote. <sighs> Oh, I see. So I, it's like a 14 year old did it. Uh, uh, <laughs> it says, like, uh, what, what the fuck? And then another word at the top the, um, uh, the M word. I wasn't laughing at that. But um, uh, it says Lamar Long Dick at the bottom after what the fuck <laughs> see you can see it if you want. i'm sorry i'm not trying to laugh at it it's just i saw what the fuck you know lamar long dick okay can you see it can you all see that? i'm sorry sometimes you like you got to have a moment of laughter before i close it out let me show you this as i promised a minute ago there's more graffiti from the same group of kids, uh, I get like, oh, on that. but there's a cemetery right behind you. That's another thing. There's a cemetery right behind here, right behind what's going to be um, turned into a FEMA 
a, a, um, a little FEMA, makeshift FEMA camp, like a turnkey FEMA camp, hiding in plain sight. But see that little device up there? Strange. I never mind. That looks new. I hope y'all can see it. The thing attached to the wall. But anyway, huh, just so uh, I never thought, I forgot all about the cemetery there. The only way to get to it is right back there, going through the Toys R Us. I forget, I haven't thought about this cemetery in probably 20 years. For some reason, it just, but it all makes sense. Huh, yeah, look at that. There's more. You know, uh, high school group. <laughs> you can see it. It's, yeah, I doubt it, but <laughs> it's the same. Talking about the same Lamar, Lamar, uh, FTHS, Lamar Long Deck, excuse my language, uh, Hellboys. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, that's interesting. And look, there's a car park back. And there's somebody in it. You see that? Look at that. You know, I saw that car earlier. And I've sensed there's somebody around and look. A Honda. Maybe like, you know. Hmm. Yeah. That's the, um. The guy in the car is kind of like the makeshift being used up as a, a, a watch person, you know, as well, because, and they're, because they're having other troubles in life. I see that psychically. But anyway, it's 12 minutes. I didn't mean for this video to go on this long. Uh, here's the other side that we were walking towards. And uh, I'm gonna close this out. All right, and I'll do a third video Probably not tonight, possibly tonight, but more than likely tomorrow on January 12th of 2018. All right, y'all. Peace.